So, what's going on people? You know, there are a lot of shoes out there and some of them, it's easy to pick up, right? You go on the Nike thing, maybe you do the draw, you win, and then that's the end of it. Maybe you have to do that through like the Foot Locker thing or something. Maybe it's just a matter of being there early enough to buy your pair. Like, it's like those Concours that came out last year. All you really have to do is just get on the website, click on them within the first like hour that they release or something, and they're pretty much yours. So some things, yeah, they're just easy. Then there are the ones that take a bit of work. And of all those ones that do take a lot of work, sometimes you don't like them all that much. But you, you want them, but they're not all that great. You, you just want them enough that it's okay to do that. But then there are the ones where you really want it and you're ready to do whatever it takes, more or less, to make those happen, right? So that's what this video is about, like the shoe that I wanted the most, that I liked the most, and took the most work to pull off, right? And along with that, I'm going to pass this little, I guess you could call it a challenge of sorts, pass that on to a couple people. So let's see who, who do we got here. Um, first and foremost, of course, we're going to go with Bobby Sneaker World. He's always got the camera ready, always ready to put videos out there for the people, for you people, some of you. So yes, Bobby Sneaker World, of course. Let's go uh, DB Kicks, switch it up. Uh, Chaotic Kicks, why not? Him too. And who else, who else? McFly, KOF, of course. And last but not least, we will go with, who was somebody who I saw recently? Hmm, we'll go with P-Town. P-Town, yeah, P-Town. 24, of course. Don't get it confused with any of those other ones. So. Those five, I'll tag you in some kind of thing somewhere. Anyways, so this shoe, right? And I remember this day very clearly. So let's break that out right here. This is an Air Max 97, right? Not just any Air Max 97. It's the Have a Nike Day version, right? You saw that on the side. It's with all kinds of text. Here's the thing about this, though. First off, I like 97s a lot. I truly do. The problem is that I usually don't see any that I really like. I like the model, but the colorways, the choices just tend to be a little lacking in my opinion. So when I do see one, I'm like, oh, I usually like it a lot, right? Like a whole lot. And even if I look at my other 97s that I have, not a lot, right? I have this here, I have this pair, I have that green and gray winter or that utility pair, and then I have the What's that? It's a tan and blue, another winter colorway. So I got two winter ones and then this one. Yeah, not a lot. But anyway, so this. I saw this and I thought to myself, I want this shoe. Wherever it is, I'm going to figure out a way to make that mine. And so I saw them later up in Seoul at the Atmos store that up there. So I went up there once, you know, saw them, thinking, okay, you know what? I'm going to get them later for whatever reason I didn't get them that day. And so I went back up there on the weekend or something. Maybe I didn't have any money on me because some stores around here, they only take Korean cards or won, right? And so my card doesn't always work. Maybe that's what the problem was. But either way, I go back up there. Now, I don't just go there, right? It's not like it's right down the street. I have to walk over to this bus station, which is about 20 minutes away take a roughly about an hour and 10, hour and 20 minute bus ride up to somewhere. From there, I ride a subway another 30 minutes. And then I walk a good 15 to 20 minutes across that town to this store, right? So I get there, I buy the shoes, everything's done, right? I go back home doing all that stuff in reverse, get back here, sit down and start doing this video. And then I go out, go over here to pull out shoe number two, halfway through the review, and you know what that shoe was? It wasn't one of these, no. It was an Air Max 2 Lite in the University Gold and White colorway, right? So I'm thinking, like, what is this? This is nonsense. How does this happen, right? Well, I'll tell you how it happens. People put things out for display, and then they put them back in the boxes, and sometimes they just mess up. Human error. I can't fault the guy for it. In a way, I kind of see a lot of it as my fault because I should have checked before I left, right? But things happen. So I'm thinking, great, now I got to go all the way back through all of this to go up there and have this corrected. 
yeah, it was a lot of hassle, like a lot, you know? But in the end, I mean, <laughs> the, the hours and hours that I wasted, because let's see, that ends up being roughly like two, two and a half hours there, then, then back, something like that, twice, same day, right? Luckily, I went up there early. So it sucked a lot, it did. But I got these, and I'm super happy to have them in the collection. I'll give you that close-up look again. I mean, this is easily one of my favorite pairs of shoes, and easily one of the hardest to get. The other hard one to get was like that, that uh, was it the Hyperspace Yeezys? That, just because I was still learning my way around Korea and all that, it, it took a bit of effort. And I don't even like those that much. That's what I was saying earlier. Sometimes you put in a lot of work for something that you wouldn't mind having. And then other times you put in a lot of work for something because it's worth it. That's where this comes in. So, for those of you that I named off in the beginning, go ahead, make your little video, let me know what this shoe is for you, right? And if you want the full review of these, you can go ahead, watch the actual review I did. It's There'll probably be a link at the top, probably be a little end card thing or something like that. Go ahead, watch it. I mean, I pretty much just told you everything other than sizing, true to size, there's that. But yeah, go ahead, do that, and for those of you who have already seen that or don't need to see it again, whatever, I have other videos. They're pretty good. Actually, you know what? We're not going to do that. We'll, I'll post some videos to some of the people that I tagged in the thing, because that makes more sense. I think what I called out four names, but I can only put four. I mean, I've called out five names, but I can only put four links. But four links and a channel in the middle. So we'll figure that out later. Thank you for watching. And I think this is my last video for tonight. Then I'm going to go and edit these eventually and get those releases staggered. So... Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a nice rest of your day, rest of your night, whatever it is, wherever you are. And come on back sometime. There will be videos. Maybe they're new. Maybe they're not. But they're still videos. All right. Later, people.